when asked to deliver an assessment of his 16-year-old striker Vinicius Jr., a player who has been described as both the next Neymar and the next Robinho depending on who you listen to. Brazil's under-17 coach Carlos Samad paused for a moment, before choosing his words very carefully. He's a promise, but we shouldn't go overboard, he began, no doubt disappointing several journalists already planning their profiles on Brazilian football's next big thing. He's a good kid, but he has a lot of mistakes to make and I just hope people are patient with him. If he stays focused despite all the glamour surrounding him, he can get to a really high level. The advice of Mud a man who clearly has the best interests of Vinicius at heart, was crystal clear, keep a watchful eye on the teenage talent, but do not burden his young shoulders with unnecessary and unfair expectation just yet. But then Real Madrid have never really been in the business of listening to the opinions of other people. Ignoring Amud's advice as well as the seemingly insignificant fact that he is yet to play a single minute of senior football, Real have decided to go out and buy the striker. The club confirmed the transfer on Tuesday, with reports in Brazil suggesting the teenager has cost somewhere in the region of £35 million. That's more than they paid for Luis Figo, Karim Benzema, and Luka Modric. That's more than 18 of La Liga's other 19 clubs have ever spent on a single player. Vinicius himself will reportedly receive two further payments of £6.76 million directly into his young savers account and be eligible to move to the Santiago Bernabe as soon as he turns 18. Which, seeing as he was born in the year 2000, will be in a year and a half's time. But who on earth is he? Teenage sensation. It should come as little surprise that at youth level at least, Vinicius has proved himself to be a bona fide teenage sensation. He joined Flamengo aged just 10 having been spotted playing football on the streets of São Goncalo, and quickly moved through the junior ranks, quickly winning call-ups to Brazilians' respective youth teams. He impressed playing for the Brazilian under-15 national side, scoring six goals in as many matches and winning the South American under-15 football championship, but it is at under-17 level that he has really shone. Vinicius finished as the top scorer at the South American under-17 championship earlier this year, finishing as the top scorer at the tournament, with seven goals. Predictably, it didn't take long for clips of his many moments of outrageous skill, including these three quick lobs which appeared to make one poor commentator spontaneously combust, to go viral. In total he has scored 19 goals in 22 matches at that age level. Popular across Europe. Given his feats at the South American Championship, something of a mecca for football scouts, Vinicius Jr. was quickly being scouted by a number of Europe's biggest clubs. Manchester United were reportedly one of the first clubs to inquire into his availability, although Ed Woodward didn't have much success negotiating with Flamengo. The talks didn't get far, their former president Kleb Leite sniffed. It didn't take long for Real's bitter rivals Barcelona to emerge on the scene either. It was rumoured in Brazil that Neymar himself had contacted Vinicius to extol the virtues of the Camp Nou, but the club proved unwilling to match the teenager's astronomic release clause. Completely inexperienced. Not only is Vinicius yet to play a game of senior football but, until this month, he had not even trained with the Flamengo first team. He is yet to make the club's match day squad for a Campeonato Brasileiro Serie A match and is waiting on his first Brazil under-21 call-up. Following in the long line of young stars. Despite his complete lack of experience at senior level, Vinicius is the next in a long line of young Brazilian footballers to attract an awful amount of hype, prior to securing a move to Europe before they've turned 20. His eye for goal and habit of dropping into deep positions so as to embark on mazzy runs past defenders have, naturally, invited comparisons with the likes of Neymar, Robinho and Gabriel Jesus, who proved an instant hit at Manchester City earlier this season, at the age of 19.
but it would be wrong to say Vinicius is destined for success. There is a long list of young Brazilian stars that headed to Europe but failed to make the grade, from Adelton to Caio Ribeiro. Real have taken a sizable gamble on Vinicius Jr., paying almost £40 million on a player who turns 17 next month. Next month.